So this is the Newt. It is a um, IoT device meant to operate at low power. The goal is for it to be able to stick to a wall like a Newt, uh, like a refrigerator or, or, or mirror. And um, you can use it for anything. You know, my plan was to use it for weather, timers, calendars, things like that, uh, to-do list. But it'd be interesting to see what the community builds with it. Um, it's powered with an ESP32S2 device and it uses a sharp memory and pixel display. The sharp display allows it, you know, quick refreshes. So different from e-ink um, and the capacitive touch um, means that it's simpler to manufacture. So I'm not doing uh, manufacturing on both sides. Um, as you see here, you got the ESP32. We have a buzzer, um, the battery, as well as a charger. Um, we've got two buttons for boot and reset. Uh, if you're using Arduino, you can code in CircuitPython as well. We have a Stemma QT connector and then um, a USB-C and, uh, and then an, an, a, a low power RTC, which lets you set uh, an alarm and timer. Um, there's a kind of a section for the uh, battery that can stick here with you know, a piece of putty. Um, I plan to design a case for it, but I haven't done that yet. But the, the goal is, is really to build something that consumes a low amount of power and we can run for months on a, on a battery. Let's go ahead and turn it on and test some of the functionality. This is going to load with some code that I've written that I plan to share that allows me to get you know, weather, you know, a quote, uh, my to-do list, a habit calendar, and, and um, timers and alarms. First thing it does is connect to, to Wi-Fi, gets the right date, gets the right time, pulls the weather and pulls a quote. Um, from there, it will go to sleep. So now it's currently sleeping. Um, the ESP32 S2 um, lets you deep sleep with one capacitive touch pin to wake. Um, so that is this pin. So we will use that to wake up and then you'll see our menu at the bottom. So we'll start first with the alarm. We'll just see if we can quickly set an alarm for 927 um, so we can test the buzzer. If I can get it before it goes off. I might set it for 9.28, just to be safe. And it is PM. So. Oh, I did too late for that to hear the buzzer. So the alarm's going off and to turn it off, you hit that button. You hit the wake button. So, um, So timer is the same thing. You can set a timer for, you know, multiple hours and it'll start a countdown. And uh, when it goes to sleep, it just shows one hour and 50 seconds and whatever. Um, and you can set the alarm at the end of time at the same time. We'll just set this an hour ahead so it doesn't go off. Um, so you'll see you have an alarm and a timer and in a second it'll go back to sleep. Um, before I let it go to sleep, I'll show you weather. So weather gets pulled every... Um, 15 minutes with my code. So I get my hourly forecast. Um, I get my daily forecast. Uh, the other thing that's interesting here in the code that I've written is I've got a to-do list um, that actually syncs with my Alexa. So it pulls, um, it syncs and connects uh, to my Alexa device. And then if I were to um, say something like Alexa, add, make dinner to my to-do list what can i add to you? make dinner add make dinner to my to-do list i have added milky and make dinner to your to-do list oh well that didn't come off right but as you can see it automatically adds that so that's kind of cool too um let's exit out of here and then the other thing that i think is kind of neat with this is that i've got a habit calendar built in um and this was inspired by uh the everyday calendar uh, that Simone G put together, but it's, you know, just a thing using EEPROM. If I want to track that I'm doing something today, I, I highlight, I go back and maybe I worked out on Monday as well. And maybe I worked out on Sunday and, or maybe I didn't work out on Sunday so I can clear that. But, um, but that's just kind of some of the, the functionality I plan to, um, to release, but yeah. that's, um, that's what it is. It's, this is, pretty much the, the final product there are a couple of minor tweaks i need to do but but this is a uh, this is it thanks